It's now been shared on social media thousands of times, a candid conversation caught on camera of military personnel discussing residential contamination. And tonight, the Army took community questions and concerns about that video at an Aliyamanu military reservation town hall. KITV Force Jeremy Lee listened in and joins us now live with tonight's top story. Jeremy. Well, Mika and Rick, the video shows an Army personnel saying, this is bad and uh, this is like high hazard. And it has left viewers speculating on, on exactly what was referred to. KITV spoke with a Red Hill military housing tenant whose camera picked up the conversation after she attended the Army town hall looking for answers. Whatever and whatever is in here is probably not yeah, likely worse. The video captured on the security camera of Red Hill resident Jamie Williams had her asking Army officials, What is worse than fuel? The answer from Colonel Masson seen in the video? What's worse than something that we thought we knew is discovering that there could be something worse. In my mind, I was thinking uh, this could be connected to every single house. We've been called to this one residence. If it rains again, is it going to go to another residence? Does this go to the drinking water system? We know that it doesn't. That irrigation system that they didn't know about beforehand, that's what she said was bad because she didn't know the ramifications of it at the time. Even after the home has been tested and the irrigation system flushed, the ramifications may still not be clear. The irrigation system has been off for two years. There has not been contaminated water that would have come through it. Um, and really the only response I got was that, it, oh, it's a separate system. And there was no real answer to what the hazard is. This is bad. This is like high hazard. Also, no other adult gets that excited over irrigation. You know, we, we know that's not the issue. Um, so I wish the Army would have addressed that more directly and let us know what is considered low, medium, and high hazard. Um, but unfortunately, that wasn't the case. It really was about the fact that if this is present here, in my mind, I'm multiplying that by 1,668 homes. And, in, in, and from my chair, that would feel like a really big problem. Unequivocally, can you look me in the face today and tell me that there is absolutely not a hazard in my front yard? I don't think that any of us could do that. That's not something we would do without running several sets of different types of tests. Nevertheless, Major General Ryan announced that even still, Red Hill is the first zone slated to return residents to homes mid-month if tests come back indicating that contaminants have been flushed out. But whereas Red Hill has 135 homes, he said AMR has 1,500 plus and will take at least until the end of the month. Reporting live, Jeremy Lee, KITV4 Island News tonight.